sponsor, a gaseous Pokemon. No further information. Butterfree. One week after Caterpie evolves into Metapod, it again evolves into Butterfree. Zubat. Flying Pokemon with supersonic powers. Zubat lives in caves and hates to fly outside in caves. Now that's a Pokédex. Assuming you all haven't been living on a rock for the past decade, you all would have at least heard of Pokemon. Now in that animated series, the protagonist Ash has a device called Pokédex, which identifies any Pokemon that he encounters, which basically is the intro of this video. Now, you might be wondering, is this a Pokemon channel now? Nah, what I'm trying to do here is to recreate the Pokédex using Flutter. Right, the first part here is super easy. I basically need an API that can provide me with all the Pokemon's information. Lucky for us, there is one publicly available, PokeAPI.co. <laughs> The next step is to pass the JSON API response and create a model class for it. Simple straightforward stuff. Now we have all the JSON passed and ready to go. Is list view the way to display all the Pokemons? Let's try that out first. Names are cool and all but it's useless without a Pokemon's image. Right, now we have the image in, we got a list of Pokemon but still, the list is kinda meh. Let's try a two column grid. Yeah, that's much better. Now let's add in some fox borders, shadows, grayish background. Finally we got some decent looking grid view. So now we have a boring app that displays a list of Pokemon. Let's move on to the fun part. To simulate a Pokédex Pokémon description and entry, I need a text-to-speech library. Lucky for us, there is a Flutter library that does exactly that. Now let's plug that in and see how it sounds. A brutal Pokémon with pressurized water jets on its shelf. They are used for high-speed tackles. Now let's take a final look at the app. I have actually updated the grid view to a nice red color with a, a subtle bubble around each of the Pokemon so it doesn't look as boring as the grey one. Let's try out the text to speech. Smile Plume. The larger its petals, the more toxic pollen it contains. Its big head is heavy and hard to hold up. Ha! <laughs> Nice. Hey guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Just wanted to try something new in between different tutorials. So guys, in the future, I'll be making more tutorials on Android and Flutter or any other programming related tutorials. If you guys want to see more, feel free to subscribe, like and comment guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.